Diwali. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening from wherever you're watching this video from. My name is Nasto. Welcome and welcome back to this YouTube channel. Thank you so much guys for clicking. I really appreciate your support. Kindly, if you haven't, again hit the subscribe button, turn on the notification bell so that wherever Nasto posts a video, you become the first person to at least uh, get notified that Nasto uh, uh, just uh, posted a video. So in today's in today's video guys, we are coming live from uh, Our adjacent village. I came here to buy at least some trees because we are going on with the construction of our gate Yeah, we are building up a home here in the village Nyabohanse village to be pre to be Precise. Hey, these days English is corner cornering. I think I should eat more green vegetables <laughs> Anyway guys, it's a super special day. The week is going on very well it's raining cats and dogs every single day it's raining and this is the outcome of a lot of rain our roads usually get uh, spoiled like this you know in, in the rural areas here mostly uh, rarely do we have tarmac roads so most of the roads are just like this uh, how do we call these type of roads guys are these weather roads or how do we refer to them kindly you can comment down below and let us know on the comment section so there's a bridge down there but the bridge is very poorly made so this road doesn't pass to the adjacent area but i hope uh very soon maybe the bridges will be made so in today's video guys we came here to buy uh, some trees for supporting our gate because we want to put at least a top slab so that it can avoid maybe the gate being rained on every single day so here are the trees this is the forests i think Buying land and also planting some trees like this can be a very good investment. Imagine because a tree here costs like uh, one and a half dollar It's 250 to 300 shillings. Just a good tree and you know the advantage of this type of trees we call them I think eucalyptus Even if you cut them like this, you see they keep uh, they keep growing every single day. So there's no You're not required like if you cut one, maybe you plant some if you cut one, they sometimes they even grow two, like this. You see, this one was cut just recently, but again, two trees came out. You see, another one is here. So I think this is a very good investment. Maybe one day in future, when I get to buy maybe a piece of land, maybe even half an acre or one acre, I will dedicate it to planting trees like this. Just plant a lot of trees and let that land be there. Because you never know, maybe one day your kids uh, want to build they can just come in a forest like this and cut down The trees for construction or maybe you need timber you can just get in here because some of the trees like this one here They're very good for For timbers this one you see this very big tree here in the next maybe two years This tree can have very good timber or rather can produce very good timber so in today's video guys, I bought around 20 trees from this uh, very big forest So we were really working on them. See even my shoulders. I was actually carrying them <laughs> Just helping out so that uh, we transport them, but I'm really scared of the roads ahead I don't know if we really managed to just pass through this road Yeah, so these are the trees Because it's been raining a lot. So the trees are spilling a lot of water you see? They, I think they had uh, a lot of water during the rainy season. 
Yeah, so we are trying to tie them here so that uh, we have at least some balance or some support as we head home. Yeah, the road is going to be very bad, but you know, pickups, I think pickups are one of the uh, strongest cars to take all weather roads. So I'll be taking you along the journey, guys, as we try and see whether we'll uh, arrive safely. But I'm very, I'm 100% sure, because even the last time when we were building our house, this was the same pickup that we used to transport the trees to our home. So I'm 100% sure. So we have, I'm here with uh, Moruga254. Moruga, the guy who almost gave up on YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> He's telling me YouTube is not vegetable. Yes, <laughs> YouTube is not vegetable. Yes. It's not for everybody. It's not for everybody. But you keep on trying. Yeah, you keep on trying. Never give up. Never. Yeah. You know there is no easy job in this world. Yeah, you have this. to struggle. Yeah, you really have to struggle. Well, Imagine a, a job like easy. this, maybe every day cutting trees, carrying them on your shoulder. Okay. And you are given an option to be a YouTuber. <laughs> so which one is the easiest? <laughs> there is no easy job. There, no there are some job. people who maybe have to... Like uh, maybe clean the sewers. They go deep in in there to do those kind of jobs. So, but, but, but with some time, yeah. I will be, I'll be adapting. Yes. So maybe you can tell them your YouTube name so that they support you. Oh. Uh, in YouTube. Yes. Uh, my name is Muruga254. You can find me on YouTube. Yes, That's my YouTube channel. Muruga254. Feel free to subscribe yes. and share, like, comment. I'm sure you will enjoy the video. Yeah, kindly, guys, go support Muruga254. Subscribe. Mura. Bariak, sama subscribe. Neto nani? Oh, neto Cynthia Mboni. Oh, when is Cynthia? Now you neto nani? Emmanuel Matiko. Emmanuel Matiko. Emmanuel Matiko. Oh, haya. Iyo ni mizuri. Amu jenda shuli. Amu mefunga. Mefunga. Mokami, tayari? Oh, yeah. Mokami is finishing up the tying. Tying these trees. He says he has some experience in tying the trees here. So we are trying to tie them. You know, we have balanced them at least uh, in the middle so that we find a good balance. So some were tied on this other end and others on this other end. Yeah, so. <laughs> how he knows how to tie this. You know this. Hey, utakata. Utakata. Okay, <laughs> just wait. <that. laughs> <laughs> Too much ugali. You know ugali you make a mean. You know. 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 <laughs> so we try again, guys. <laughs> this man is saying that Mukami should uh, give him some energy. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, yes, Thank you, Gamba Haki. Thank you, Gamba Haki. Okay, good evening. Good morning. Good morning. Again, all of us. So, your name is? Uh, my name is John Maragosiani. This is Maragosiani. my area. This is your area. Yo? Yes. Yeah. Okay, and uh, I'm supporting to take something to, mm. to, to our uh, home. No. Mm. To car. To car. Oh. Yeah, to trees to car. Yes. Oh. <laughs> not a vehicle. Not a vehicle. This is a car. It's not a vehicle. Yes. So, and that is. Uh, no, you know, actually, no. yesterday, huh? yesterday uh, there was a comment. You know, someone was telling me the van is hey. not a car. Hey. You know, a car is a, a small. Vehicle, vehicle. So this is not your vehicle. vehicle, this is your car. Yeah. Yeah, guys, you can maybe yeah. you can educate us. You know, yeah. yesterday I was trying to argue so, with someone. Yeah. He was telling me that the van is not a car. So for me, I only knew. You know, for me, you know, in Swahili, gari. You know, car means gari. So maybe for me, I always thought that a car is any movie. Any movie. Any movie. Ah, uh, no. Yeah. No. So a car is a, like a Something small. That, uh, yeah. Yes. 
So like yeah. this is a car. This is, is a car. Yeah, this is somehow a car. This is a pickup. Pick this is not a car. It's a car. <laughs> so you're confusing me. It's <laughs> not a car. If you, you know, if you, you know, know, know a car is it's, it's like a general name. No, 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 for, no, no, for, no, no, for small no. vehicles. No, you see like uh, uh, those small cars that look like yeah, like, like a Toyota Corolla. Yeah. That now is a car. It's a car. Yeah. The one I have is a van. A van. It's not a car. <laughs> <laughs> and a vehicle. A, a vehicle is another one. General name. So, yeah, maybe a vehicle yeah. is a general, general name. Vehicles. Yeah. Vehicles. Yeah. yeah. You know, so maybe the car. Are confusing. Maybe the car falls yeah. under a vehicle. You know when you, you want to divide them and yeah. group yeah. them? Yeah. You will come and. Uh, yeah, you have a lorry. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, maybe you can tell us in the comment section what is the difference between a vehicle, a car, a pickup, a. Yeah, maybe someone can write to us maybe the main difference because even for me yesterday I wanted to argue with someone that was saying that uh, maybe uh, the van is not a car so when I went to do some research maybe the difference between a van and a car I really was shocked so yeah that's how we get to learn every day yeah. 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 So we are preparing ourselves with a, a spade in case maybe we get stuck. We'll be using the spades to at least move. Hey. 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 Jody, <laughs> 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 He says he's drunk, he can't manage to stay. <laughs> yeah, it's good that he cares about his concern. Who is he? He is a guy. He is a guy. He is a guy. He is a guy. He is a Off we start our journey, guys. We are still jaribu to panda up on you. I can get that, sir. So maybe we will be carried with the Mokami with the motorbike. The good thing is that we are inside the car. <laughs> inside the car. <laughs> But you know, for me, I, I always believe in pickups. Pickups are usually very, very strong. Especially the old model, not these new, these ones. new ones. But but for now, you know... You know, this one maybe was here before even uh, we were born. Yeah. You might find it's maybe 40 years or even 50. Smoothly. 
So the other person behind there is the one checking whether the trees maybe are on one side. Village kids grazing. you can uh, ride a bicycle I think automatic you can but these ones are very hard with the gears you have to know how to balance the clutch and uh, yeah the fuel and the brakes you know the other one only has two you know this is actually like a motorbike so people are building guys people are building new homes left there. <laughs> Farming is not easy. Agriculture is not easy. They are the hardest. You have to spend a lot of money, energy. Especially if maybe you can't hire people. You are the only person you depend on yourself maybe to, to go to their farm every single day. So it's not an easy thing. Sometimes farming, you can invest in farming. It does, it does not bring fruits. Yeah. And you know the problem with uh, maybe our place, everyone plants the the same, yeah. the same maize. And so during harvesting, you find the prices have gone down. Then, uh, then there is this issue: you, you plant the re repetitive one one crop yeah, for yeah. a long period of time until there's now the, the the soil is it's unfertile. Yeah, 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 yeah. So far, so good, guys. The the journey is uh, smooth. It's only one place that is a challenge, but I, I am sure we are going to, to because also it's it's a slope. It's not like going up here.
this is the only shop that we have along this road so very bad up there so there's a so there's another challenging place here so we need maybe to remove the the small uh, type of hills you see this is how our village looks like but you know when I was starting YouTube there was one day I crossed this river using a tree that was just laid like this so at least right now at least we have a bridge here guys yeah, there was a video I did and this place was very flooded, the road was very bad, there was no bridge, so no one could access the other side, especially cars and everything. So, just look at the condition of this road. So the pickup can only pass maybe here, but there's a small problem uh, at the middle, so it needs to be repaired. So, we are going now with the spades, you see maybe you can balance somewhere here here like this but in front here is a very big challenge maybe like the inamiti yeah oh. the... mm. Oh, <laughs> This is Pesaman. Mm. Hi. How are you, Pesaman? I'm very fine. Yes. What of you? I'm good too. Yeah. Yeah. What are you Maybe dealing with here? We are uh, harvesting sand at this place. Oh. And also controlling this water from disturbing the, the road. The road. Oh. Yeah. So, how are you people? people This is Pesaman. He is telling me that he has some sand here. Yeah. That maybe is uh, selling. I think they have already sold one. Yeah, one, 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 one yeah, you know this is good sand. At least for making blocks. So at least you know this road was recently opened so they have another sand here. Oh, yeah. I think he goes away. He ni kama yam ton. The river. Yeah. 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 This one is very good, you know. So you, you are three of you. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah three of yes. So your name is uh my name is uh Devisinia, you know. Devisinia. Devisinia. Uh -huh. Yeah. So I'm the one who I'm harvesting this sand. Yeah. So we are just uh, doing some good job, you know. Yeah. The other yeah. day I sold it to Lord Joseph there. 
Oh, you were the one who's. Yeah, oh, the other land there. You know, yeah. Oh, yeah, you know, yeah guys. That is where Cloud Joseph. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, so I'm the one who sold to him this land. Okay. So you have another one that you are selling? Oh, yeah, yeah. It's finished. No. Land. Not <laughs> sand. <laughs> <laughs> land, yeah. The other one is there. Uh, yeah. The but other one. don't sell everything, yeah? <laughs> so that maybe one day your kids, they Hello. don't, they don't yeah. beat you. <laughs> I mean this, I mean this. Yes. I sold him the sand. Oh, the land. not the land. Not the oh, land. you sold Cloud the sand. I, I sold I think this one is good. Maybe next time I will come and uh, get some. Uh, no from, problem. Uh, yes. No problem. There's, yeah, there. there is plenty of, of There's sand. plenty yeah. of sand. At, at yeah. least, guys, you can see here they are getting some sand from from just the roadside. Yeah. And also, as they get the sand, they prevent the water maybe from going directly to yeah. the to the uh, road. So this is Pesaman. He also has a YouTube channel. Yeah, go check me out yes. at Pesaman. Pesaman is P E S A. Air and man. Yes. Yeah, so yeah, combined. All right. So yeah, let's see how our car will manage. Full force. <laughs> 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 Hey, he has managed. Hey. That guy is a uh, no joke. Yeah, we have also okay, another YouTuber here. Actually. Yes. <laughs> Yo, what's up, guys? Yes. Uh, welcome back to Nasto's channel. Yes. I go by the name Your Majesty 254. Your Majesty 254. Yeah, yeah. Like you can see, I've got a spade with yeah. me right here. Yes. Yeah, Trying to earn an honest living. Yeah, of course. Yes. Yeah, so <laughs> honest living. Yeah, this is an yeah. honest living. You're not stealing <laughs> from anyone. Stealing you. Yeah. Using yeah. your own energy. Using your own energy. Least, uh, by the end of the day, you get something. So, guys, you can check me out at Your Majesty 254. Yes. Please, please yes. subscribe to my YouTube channel. Your Majesty 254. Yeah. yeah. Support I them, think guys. I should show you mine here. Yeah? Oh, you're also a YouTuber. I am. Have you seen it? So, uh, oh, we just started. Senior, or, you know. Yeah, I've just started. Yes. Yeah, you know. I should show you. Yeah, yeah, so this yeah. is uh, Devi Senior also, guys. You can go check him out. Tell it, tell it. I'm not going to go. Yeah, I will go on foot. Yeah. It's almost close. I will walk. We are going. Yeah, so this yeah. is uh, Devi Devi. Senior. Devi Senior. So you know, Devi Senior, I come and take a few boys. You have two names. You have Devi Senior and also you have Geoffrey Gintu. No, that's... Uh, that's, uh, I think that's, you know the names will be email. the same. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You that's have to email. you have to put the names to be at least the the same so that you know when someone will search Davis Senior. Let me show you. No bundles. Hmm? No bundles, sir. No bundles. Yeah, no bundles. You have to change. All of them have to be the same. Okay. Davis Senior, Davis Senior, so that you increase the chances of someone maybe finding your channel. Okay. Yeah. The email doesn't change. Yeah. Yeah. So I look at you. Huh? Yeah, well, no okay. problem. Okay, okay, guys, thank you. Yes. Welcome, welcome. All right, no problem. Tawashtua. Nikita kam changa nta kuambia. Ah, yeah, no problem. So, guys, you see, the roads are really bad. Uh, so the guys, at least, they are getting sand and also trying to, uh, also trying to maintain the road. So kindly go support the young men there. Yeah, I think also very soon I could be getting some sun because this this is the best period to start at least uh, uh, to start at least making the blocks maybe for the dream house. Yeah, slowly by slowly, slowly by slowly as we store the blocks. So very soon I'm going also to get uh, maybe two or three tippers of sun. A tipper goes for like fifty dollars. Yeah, so once I'm okay. You know me, I always like just doing things slowly by slowly, no pressure. So the guys are already uh, are already home, I believe. Yeah, it was just a walking distance, so I just told them to just go and I will follow back. So let me run and catch up with them and also help in uh, offloading the trees. So young men are really busy guys, trying to find a living by collecting sand here and there. Yeah. Hey. Hey. This young man here has very good sound. Tipo no zanga ngapi we? Bili metan. Lakini yeye jafika tipo. Nduna endelea bad. What? Yeah, this guy has very good sound. So he sells a tipo at 2500 Kenya shilling. Very young boy. 
Oh, na ingine pal. Asa po chini tipa ina shuka. Ah, asi kaya. Oh, na hamisho na yata pal. Ano yun na? Gilbert masigas. Gilbert masigas. Ah. Oh. Sawa ba? Ni kita kam chang. Takuja ni wachangi. Ah. Ah. Ano ni juo? Ni na ishpi apa kadi? Ah. Yeah. So the other young man also is. It's called Gilbert Masegeso. Yeah, life in the village, guys, is not easy. Not easy at all. I know some some of you could be watching that kind of a guy, maybe doing that kind of a job. But trust me, sometimes it just forces you to just go out there and look for maybe things for yourself. Yeah. So when you have at least a supportive parent, be very happy. Be very happy, and also be very grateful to your parents, maybe for. Always taking care of you, always uh, uh, giving you the basic needs like food, shelter. Trust me, there are some people out here who really wish to have maybe uh, parents who really take good care of them. So never take for granted <coughs> the support that you get maybe from your parents or your guardian. Never take that for granted. You see a young man like that, he's barely maybe 15 years old, but he has to come to the river there. To get sand, at least sell to a tipper, and also there are some people who steal those sand. So it's very, it's very, it's not easy, not easy. Yeah, sometimes we find parents they say, "Hey, me, I cannot take you to school." So you just have to go out there and become a man yourself. Yeah, so not easy at all, not easy. So when I'm, I'm able, I will come and get at least sand from them. So that at least your yeah, life goes on well. So we are almost home. Whew. So today the main job was buying uh, those trees for fixing our gate. Want to build a very nice uh, top slab uh, for the gate, and then now we see how everything goes by. Yeah. Yeah. So we are home. I think also this, I don't know if I should be harvesting this sun, <laughs> just kidding, <laughs> yeah, oh, they already prepared this place, so at least now the, at least now the pickup just got in easily, so we are offloading now the trees, yeah, yeah. You're <laughs> 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 offloading them now. I'm trying to look for a thumbnail. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Oh, how about? I'm going to go you mean dog it always? He may mum it always. At least we need somehow big, big trees. Yeah. So these ones are very good for support. And also, once we are done, maybe with the gate, we can build a chicken house here using these trees. So nothing will go to waste. Nam na ra? Kocho njo? Yeah. So yesterday's work, we were trying to. Ibi, what made that cement? Eh. Two hundred. Hey, hey. You know, yesterday we got some uh, cement, so they really need to also bring them here. Yeah, so they did the first plastering. I think they will also do another one. So, you know, this one was just to prevent 
and also this trench could we could build it just uh, fairly thank you so much to all the people who are commenting and uh, giving me advice i will take all of the advice into consideration but it's uh, always good to plaster you know it's not like we were removing the soil and just leaving it there we were just removing it and then plastering it just to give the the foundation some good strength yeah to give the foundation some good strength you see plastering really helps a lot a lot a lot and also uh, you know the our our soil here especially in our, the village is not is not that maybe soft it's very hard soil even if you use maybe a mud in building it's very stable because when digging the foundation you have to dig it until you go to a maram and then now start putting your stones you can't just dig maybe a shallow hole and start construction you have to really go deep until you find a hard surface and then now from there it's now when you start building your wall and also remember our wall also has this uh, these pillars so it's very strong it's a very strong wall and also very durable and also on top we have another uh, another uh lentil so the wall is very stable so it's only that you know taking precautions maybe from molds growing on your wall or the wall maybe uh sitting on stagnant water for long so those are the things that i was just trying to prevent but the wall is very strong because we really used strong metals and we were not taking like a uh, long distance see so this is a pillar it's a very big pillar and also there's another pillar on top all over you see the metals so that is what holds the the wall so down here i'm just trying to prevent maybe water from staying for long close to the wall so he has already arrived at work he's really doing an amazing job he has cleaned the compound he has really cleaned this place it really looks clean 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 so yesterday i told him to at least leave a small space for also for plastering you see this is what plastering does to your wall. Yeah. I can't wait to move here. We just have a small problem, but we are fixing it. Maybe very soon I'll be traveling to go and at least look for an expert to sort this uh, type of a problem. Yeah. So this is our home, guys. Maybe for the new subscribers, this is uh, the home that... I'm really trying so much to work on. So let me go pay the, the guy that uh, was having the pickup and then we continue. Yeah, you see, so this is how our store looks like. It's a bit disorganized, <laughs> but no cement. So let's go and uh, get the bags. Yes, guys, so after the delivery of uh, the trees, officially now we have started using the trees in uh, preparing our gate. Let me show you guys. Uh, what we are doing actually it's day two again uh, this video is a continuation of yesterday's video so good morning again good afternoon again and good evening from wherever you're watching this video from so uh, already now because yesterday it rained too much so i could not complete my video just look at how dangerous this is this is a nail and it has been put the other way around so already now we have started guys preparing now our gate let me show you from uh, outside so so this is how now we have already started now supporting our gate. The slab I was talking about is now going to be lying up there. Yeah, up there is where now we are just going to put just a little bit of uh, uh, a slab. It's not too big, not too small again, just medium. So that uh, our precious gate here that we bought the other day does not get rained on. And also it adds a lot of beauty to the to the gate and also to the house that to the houses that uh, are inside the compound you know <laughs> they always say that the face <clears throat> or rather the appearance of something is now what maybe could tell you what is inside uh, the compound so from here this is just how we are uh, uh, preparing so the trees that we just bought will now be supporters all along uh, along here now they will run some will run like this so yeah i just hope uh, we'll have uh, an amazing gate so we have uh mokami has gone to the border town to get uh to get the to get some of the steel the mason here told me that he needs uh, around 10 steel for this gate so we have gone to buy the steel although everything now is going high 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 every morning every day the government keeps adding taxes so yeah so that's how it is so 
this is just how the gate looks like guys yeah maybe you can comment down below what do you think about uh, our gate here so uh, the timbers that uh, or rather the trees that we bought previously most of them have become too dry so they could not be able to hold to hold the to hold the weight of the slab that is going to be slipping up there so that is just how so that's why we had to add more like 20 of them and also these ones uh, because construction is still going on and this home will be will be keeping uh things like birds uh one day we'll also love to keep uh, rabbits just like the ones i've seen at mora's place a good thing i've really liked about rabbits although i've never eaten a rabbit i just lo love how they keep growing because you only had two but right now they are all over 10 so i really also love to maybe get a good breed a good breed just like the one maro has maybe keep a few rabbits here you know rabbits even uh, a son or if you have a child they always love feeding them so those are the kind of activities that keep the homestead and also uh fertilizer fertilizer or rather the the i don't know if it's called rabbit dung <laughs> or yeah i think it's called the dropping so the droppings from the rabbits and also the chicken are one of the best 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 in uh in uh in putting in a farm so this is now how guys everything looks like so our gate very soon we are now going to pour uh, the slab up there and then we see uh, where now we'll be proceeding to so inside so these are the kind of the trees uh, so they were cutting them uh, according to the length length or the height of the gate so mama Ann has brought us also some breakfast too. mama Ann, yeah. Nandele <laughs> 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 Oh, so she says that another part uh, her son will be sleeping and another part will be used as a kitchen so yeah. this is mama and she always brings for us a food maybe lunch uh things like that lunch breakfast for the masons here and uh yeah the, also water in in case we have maybe scarcity of water so yesterday also we bought some some of the nails so here are the nails that we bought yeah this is the young man here they came with him here he's holding a mandazi <laughs> yeah so we are here with him we came to survey what is going on here you know during the morning whatever you want maybe to, to go out of the compound they start crying hey let's go together let's go together so today I always bring him here in the morning, especially morning hours, just to try and show him the environment and everything. So, yeah, we appreciate everything. So we have Mr. Yeo here. Yeo, come here. Yeye, come I see he has started expanding the the kitchen garden. Yeah, so that because uh, the car roads, he wants to uh, transfer them. Yeo, come here. You know Vip. Abariza subui. In the future, yes, yes, it's early morning again. Yes, now for high. Yes, while I was the known farm, I'm telling you, now he's supposed to go to the barber shop and at least trim. I'm not a good man, Dave. I'm not a good man. Now for high, while I'm known farm, yes, now while I'm known farm, now it's a yo come a yo, yes, Kijana on a storm, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wakati mwingine nipo kwa blaza mayugu na wakati mwingine kwa blaza maro. Yes. Jamani nashukuru kwa watu mnao toa support kwa blaza maro, blaza mayugu no, blaza nasto. Utanguka, utanguka. Majia, Misifule, yes. Mabele Musa, Cyprian, yes. Kevo 001 yes. na pia kwa wale wote mnao ni support mimi yeo yeah, kama yeo. Yeah. Nasema tu ni nayo flag kwa sababu ya kitu kimoja yes. bila support yenu nafikiri hata mimi mwenyewe nisinge kuwa hapa nasema tu wewe ni mweke huyu akai kai ndakuka ai kaa safe naweza tu kusema ya kwamba jamani ninashukuru nimeamka salama na kwa wale ambao mjaamka salama yes tazidi kuombea Mungu awatie angalau nafu yeah. unajua 
Unajua mtu unapogonjeka kwa mfano tu kidogo unajua moyo ndio wago unafadhaika kabisa 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 Mimi mwenyewe nilipokuaga na, na umo mara ya kwanza yeah. nilikuaga najifikiria kwamba kumbe kila kitu katika mwili wa binadamu ni cha muhimu ni cha muhimu yeah, ndipo yeah. nilipojua kwamba kila kitu <laughs> kila kiungo chochote cha mwanadamu hata kidole hata kidole yes jana penyewe imagine nilikuwa ah. nashusha simenti mlango kanibana kwa hapo hivi ah, pole, 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 pole. lakini sio mbaya nashukuru Mungu kwa sababu story imefunguliwa e, imefunguliwa okay, yeah. sema tu ilikuwa ni mkono wa left mkono ninaotumia kazi sana Most sana ni right yeah so ye, ye, yesterday got a small injury they were they were uh, they were offloading the bags of cement that we just bought the other day for the construction of the gate so he had a small injury on the finger so that's why he says he realized that every part of the human body is very very important even a even a nail once it uh, it starts maybe uh, itching you find it that uh, everything is very important and also you know when we are healthy like this we should always love to appreciate god for giving us maybe another day another morning that day that maybe you fall sick is when i realize hey, so i've been taking for granted uh, uh my health or everything yeah so twende tuone zile cement zile tulishusha so kuja twende ni kwach jana yenyewe yeah ni rekebisha kwa huku hivi ila mpango kile kifosi cha pale ambacho kilikuwa kimebakia nije nikiwekea kwa hapo hivi afae yote ni nani yeah so also guys you know we want to plant uh some green vegetables i think they can do well on this uh soil here because it's very very fertile and the more it, it gets rained on i think hapo uh, tunaweza tukapanda mboga eh yeah, yeah. tutapanda hata za kurusha yeah, ama hata sukuma za kurusha hata sukuma eh hata mama ana bana hata tukipanda hapa makobe si atakoma makobe itakoma yeah. sana sana i think we need to plant some green vegetables here yeah. ama nsaga kwanza nsaga zinaweza na yeah we ha- you know we have a lot of green vegetables in our community we have saga which i think it's called the spider web we have makobe we have mrenda so meanwhile you can just get some few seeds we throw them here so that uh, at least we have uh, something you know they usually take a very short time hivi makobe kwa kiingereza inaitwa makobe tu makobe hata ah iko na jini something piece something piece inaitwa nimesahau lakini ina ina jina ya kina ina jina eh hata mrenda ina jina ya hata mrenda hata nsaga mrenda ina gani mrenda <laughs> nimesahau tu kidogo yeah. lakini unaona zile mbegu ambazo tuko tunano yeah. kumbuka unaona zimeandikwa na zimeandikwa eh yeah. yeah you know the the seeds that we bought uh, previously most of them had the english name yeah. so all of them have so guys let's go and check the bags of cement that we just brought yesterday pita hapa juu Pita hapa juu siangu. Hapa hivi ni pakia na Alexis sumo. Mara kwanza nilitumia jembe. Ya yeah, ya yeah, ya. Yeah. Ikabidi ni Hata hapa unajua sasa itabidi taratibu tunaweka hii slab kama. Okay. Uh-huh. You know this place because of the rain. Yeah, I think yeah. every single day we have to be adding uh, some slab like this for hardening. You yeah. see? We left here. So I really wish we had gone up to maybe that size so that the water is ndo maji hata yana yawe yana yana shuka kwa mfano pita hapo juu kwa mfano hii imefukwa hivi pole imefukwa hii wagena chaka so nakumbuka gani iliweka gani mingine hapo hii eh hii inazeeka yeah this bags of cement usually they really get full toka hapo kisima pita hapo pita hapo pita hii ni mbaya hii mbaya kanguka ndani ndani panda juu Yeah. Ah, yeah. So let me show you guys the bags of cement that we just bought the other day so that uh, no one says hey nasto kona kona. Yeah. So these are the 30 bags of cement. I think they have used a few. They were supposed to be 26. Yeah. Wale te 26. Yeah, 26. Toka hapo ndani. Usifungiwe ndani. Yeah, 26. Yeah so so mama na hapo kidogo hivi nionyeshe. Yeah so these are the Hoja kama hapo baba. Hapa ndani kuna dudu. Dudu kwa hapa kubwa. Dudu kwa hapa tena itoe. Dudu. Yeah so these are the bag uh, these are the wheelbarrows that we have been using and I'm really happy that they are still in a very good condition. Very good condition. Even the spades. Yeah. Umeniekea huko? Eh iko kwa tamu. Sawa sawa sawa. 
So nothing has ever spoiled. Even the, I think they're really taking good care of our build construction materials. Even the spades, you know, mostly they, they usually get lost. So the spades are doing good. The wheelbarrows are in a good condition. I bought two pangas. I'm seeing one here, and there's also one out there. So most of the things are. I'm a shayenda. Do do metorok. I'm a kimbia. Kimbia. Kimbia meenda. Kimbia meenda. Bali. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So you know. Yeah. Oh, because there's a lot of water coming from uh, up here on this farm and also you remember guys we don't have a wall on this side so a lot of water just comes from the top from all those homesteads all the way to our compound so i'm telling you at least here when we are, we are doing weeding we can make something like a small trench here at least to stop maybe the yeah the force of water from coming from that upper side so also today we want to try and maybe uh my uh, or rather move some of the trees that are close to the wall and see maybe a good place but some also we can leave them just to grow maybe to a certain height before they start destroying the wall we cut them down and now uh and uh maybe use them in construction of any anything that will be here so thank you so much guys yesterday it was the first time we were buying materials for uh, constructing our gate or rather for supporting our gate so i really really appreciate everyone who keeps watching our videos kindly don't skip the ads uh like the video also drop a comment what you think about maybe uh this uh this uh video of today so thank you so much guys i'll be seeing you in our next video liam say my bye say my bye bye i say my bye 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 say my subscribe all right guys bye